So I'd like to welcome you. This is a very exciting day for us. This is our first day of becoming the stewards of uh, the River Garden, and it gives us great joy and happiness uh, to be able to celebrate with all of you. So thank you for coming. Um, and I want to thank uh, BABB for choosing us to be the next stewards of the River Garden. Uh, we take that uh, with great pride and a sense of duty into continuing with the mission of keeping the place open uh, since this is the heart of Brattleboro. And we hope to continue creating events as BABB did in welcoming the community. We also want to um, turn this center into a farm food education center. Uh, we have uh, dreams and hopes. Our first dream is to, number one, uh, make this building more energy efficient. Uh, we have a number of people who are volunteering their time, their um, expertise in these areas. We also want to get a cooling system after we button up this building as well as uh, we want to add a kitchen, which is very needed. We want to use the kitchen uh, for education. We want to provide uh, cooking lessons and nutrition lessons for the community at large. Uh, and especially, we want to continue with the education uh, for um, low-income folks who can benefit from it. Uh, we have lots of volunteer already who have signed up uh, to work uh, for us at the River Garden. We call them the ambassadors of the River Garden, but we're always looking for more people. Um, sitting here are a few people, and some, unfortunately, were not able to be here, are some folks who uh, really deserve a lot of credit for helping make this come true. It wasn't an easy uh, road uh, with lots of bumps uh, because it's a community building. And I'd like to mention those folks. Uh, we have from BABB, uh, Kate O'Connor. Um, Kate, would you come up? Uh, we have Jack Davidson, uh, who's always in the background. But uh, Jack is really does a great deal uh, for Strolling of the Heifers. He's the president of Strolling of the Heifers. Kate O'Connor is the vice president of BABB. And Morris Casey is here from um, our board of um, Strolling of the Heifers. And um, most importantly, I'd like to thank, from the bottom of my heart, Fletcher Proctor, um, the attorney who has helped mix, make this thing uh, come to a reality. Also, in um, the backgrounds that you never see is a very important person, Martin Langeveld. Uh, who does all the marketing and everything else for Strolling of the Heifers. Martin, would you please come up here? And Julie Potter, our general manager. Helen Robb, from day one. <laughs> from day one. <laughs> Helen is always there, um, encouraging me uh, to continue with all my ideas. Um, and let's see, who else is here? Um, Jerry Goldberg. <laughs> who is who? Who doesn't know this yet? Um, Jerry, for many years, from day one, has helped me and encouraged me with the strolling of the heifers, um, and all the reporters here. <laughs> Please come up! Please come up! Because these are the guys who have helped us bring our mission, which is connecting people with the food they eat. And I can't thank you enough for all of that. And we're hoping, you never know with these things, we're hoping that um, they'll be done um, as a grand opening in June for the uh, Strolling of the Heifer Parade and Festival, the first weekend in June. And the way we're going to make it sustainable, we'll also be renting it out to various organizations um, and some, some private parties. Um, and I'm, we're thinking that the events, um, intergenerational activities, uh, the farm food education um, activities that we'll have here will only enhance and bring people in here more. We want everybody to feel comfortable. We're very fortunate. We were able to uh, secure a USDA mortgage. 
uh, for $175,000. And uh, we're going after um, foundation uh, funds uh, to help us with the renovation. And uh, we also have an appeal out to the community, so we're hoping that community members can help us as well. So if anybody has any ideas of where we should approach um, any foundation or anyone else, uh, let us know. We'd be happy um, to take those um, suggestions. So thank you so much for um, helping us celebrate our first day um, at the River Garden.